$1 versus $250,000 private island. Okay, chat. Okay, Mr. Beast. Okay, Mr. Beast. Let me see what you got, bruh. 250 million. This is a 215 million dollar private island. This is a private. Bro, if I had a private island, I'll let all y'all niggas up, bro. For real, bro. Chat, I'm dead ass, bro. For real, for real. Chat, I'm dead ass, bro. If I had a private island, I'll let all y'all niggas pull up, bro. And, and that's, bro, I'm telling y'all, bro. I got y'all, bro. No cap, bro. I'm letting y'all pull up to my house right now. Why well, wouldn't I let y'all pull up to my private island? Literally anything you could ever want is on this private island. And I'm gonna show you the difference between this and a $150 million luxury island. <laughs> a massive $45 million island, a $5 million frozen island, what? all the way down to the world's cheapest private island. I need that. that. Thing. I'm starting to realize we might not all fit on it. <laughs> First step on my brand new island. Here's your dollar. Thank you, sir. Thank you for selling it to me. It's yours now, buddy. Let's check out what I just bought. My first impression is it's a lot smaller than I thought. When you pay a dollar, you get a random pile of bricks, an old toilet. I found the restroom. And oh, a bunch nah. of random wooden poles. There's more poles than square feet on this thing. They're actually called pylons. Let's pile onto that boat and leave. And as you can see, there's nothing here. So I'm gonna blow it up. But later in this video, we're going to a $150 million island and also a quarter billion dollar super island. But first, we're gonna head over to the one million dollar island called Monkey Island. Ooh. Yes, you- Monkey Island. Let me guess who goes there. Monkey Island. Heard me right. This island is literally- I think it's a set home sweet home. Yo! Yo, 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 yo. Yo, now nah, this nigga's wildin'. They swarmed with hundreds of monkeys. Oh, I can shit. see why it's called Monkey Island. <laughs> What's this monkey? Oh, it's Odie. Oh, oh, Odie took my orange. Okay. <laughs> monkey seafood, monkey take. All the monkeys on this island have no! a strategy for interacting Agent with people. Man, they gaslight you into thinking that you're friends, and then they Steve! steal your food. You can have it, you can have it. I love this monkey. There's a monkey on the boat. And if you're wondering where you and your friends are gonna sleep on this island, suspended above the water are six luxury cabanas, which house both humans and monkeys. Nah, that's fire. The monkeys grabbing the GoPro, Jimmy. Sir. Wait. So you can tell you, you could be busting cheeks in that motherfucker and a monkey gonna watch you do that? Nah, bro, I need privacy, gang. Okay? Need this for filming? I just need to borrow this. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Okay, I got my camera back. You want to, whoops. Oh, <laughs> yes, oh. he wants your hat. Okay, you, you can have that, sir. By the end of this, I'm gonna be naked. The monkeys are stealing everything. <laughs> and the monkeys are not even the coolest part of this island. See, this island isn't even an island at all. It's actually on top of a massive underwater plant network that what? emerged from the sand and water to create this illusion of an island that we see today. Is this a million dollar island what? or a million dollar bush because there's no land? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> I think an island is what you make of it. And on the other side of the island, there's even a private relaxation area and a beachfront massage parlor. Nolan, I'm trying not to fall in the water. I'm about to get a massage with a monkey. That's really cool. Notice how all the water around you is freezing. What? Whoa! That took a lot of effort. And we put that much effort in to convey that the $5 million island is very cold. And where we're going next, most of the year looks like this. But it's going to look like this. No joke, this Damn. island is so cold right now that the lake around it is actually frozen solid. Which means to get there, we're gonna be using an interesting vehicle. We're literally hovering. Yeah, apparently snowmobiles are just too basic for this island. It just had to be hovercrafts. Awesome. Talk about arriving in fashion. And it only took about 30 seconds of being outside the hovercraft for the game to be frozen solid. How cold is it? It's zero degrees Celsius. It's pretty cold, man. He's like, he more like a 70 guy. <laughs> and so they hurried over to these futuristic self-heated huts to stay warm. Oh, this is so small. Wait, there's no room for you in here. Uh, we're gonna have to cuddle them. These huts are able to stay here completely year round because not only can they float on warm, peaceful lake water, but they also do just fine in the dead of winter. But at least in the winter, you get a great view of the Northern Lights. For $5 million, you basically get a winter wonderland. And while staying on this island, you're given unlimited five-star food. I think he thinks we speak Finnish. <laughs> 
And even though this island comes with a luxury cabin to stay in. Oh, this is beautiful. This is Fine, I'll take it. Jimmy, buy it for me. The gang ended up spending most of their time on the frozen lake. Was that fucked up? I apologize, bro. That's probably the most. Yo, my fault, bro. What the fuck did I just say, bro? That might have been fucked up, bro. My fault, bro. Where they were able to ride an actual dog sled. Oh, you took your glove. <laughs> oh my God. This is the best island. I don't know how any island's gonna beat this. Maybe one where I could feel my hands. And Carl's hands are in luck because the next island is not only warm, but more expensive than all of the other. I don't like that island. That island was lame. I don't, I don't like that island, bro. Uh, Chad, you have fun with that, that island right there? Islands combined. This island is tiny, but arguably one of the most luxurious ones out there. Okay, let's go check out the house. 16 million? Wow. Oh, wow. <gasps> We're stoked to have you as our guest. We hope you have a blast. Just don't break anything. No Yo, way. we should try to break one thing. <laughs> Ooh, nice bathroom. Usually, rich people like showers that can fit like 30 to 1,000 people in them. This time, they chose a reasonable shower. <laughs> when you pay $16 million, in addition to a shower that's the size of the $1 island, the private island comes with this helicopter that's apparently too big what? for the island. We have jet skis, we have a submarine, another submarine to the right. We have a shark submarine over there. There's almost a submarine for each of us. Nah, we don't do submarines, I'm sorry. Ha, I can't, no can do. I'll swim. Okay, I'll swim. Boys, do whatever you want. Have fun. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, really bad. Oh, oh. Yeah. Yo, this is so yeah. fun. Yo, oh, right. tubing is so oh, fun. Yeah. What's my to be? To get off of this thing. And after Ludwig and Carl kissed the sea at 500 miles per hour, we went back to shore to take a little breather. Yeah, Ludwig's gonna jump out of a helicopter. He what? really is. No, wait, I'm not, wait, what? Any last words? I won't be long, I'm sorry! This helicopter is taking the boys up into the air and letting them jump and free fall into the ocean. Oh my God. What? This is crazy, we shouldn't be doing this. This is only a $16 million island and we're jumping out of helicopters. He's about to jump! Oh my god! Nigga like me would've did a backflip, easy. Nigga like me would've did a front flip, nigga like me would've did a side twist, motherfucker. Word. Wait. Yo? Yo. You call me? Nah, they playing on that All right, man. All right, buddy. Oh, man. Oh, wait, they jump! There he goes! <laughs> now, whoever said money doesn't buy happiness doesn't own that private island. Because I'm pretty happy. And now the $45 million island. This island is so big. Wait, Chad, what are we doing? Wait, whoa. Chad, what are we doing for Valentine's Day, bro? Fuck. I just thought about that. Like, what is we doing for Valentine's Day, bro? I don't got shit to do for Valentine's Day, bro. Like, damn, what the fuck do we do? Big, you can't even fit it all in frame. Oh, hey, oh, I didn't even realize they were waiting on us. I always feel uncomfortable when I pull up to places and people are just standing, potentially for hours waiting on me. <laughs> We have some blueberry smoothies here. Is it alcoholic? No, no. it is not. He's not 21. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll take you guys up and we'll show you around Royal Island a little bit. Let's see what $45 million gets us. It's a long path. The path is longer than the lost island. For $45 million, this island comes with a mansion and its own beachside bar and private chef. Can I give it a flip? Sure. <laughs> and outside of the mansion is a hot tub overlooking the cove where the jet skis are. And of course, a pool with the best view I've ever seen. 
Does this look as cool on camera as it does in real life? And if for some- Okay, I'm not gonna lie, bro. An island would be so fire for like, Cheddar, I don't would be so far for like a getaway. Like, bro, I'm tired of niggas. You feel me? Let me go go away real quick. AMP Island. Ooh, we need that. For some reason you don't want to stay in the mansion, there's five luxury beachside cabanas you can pick from. Jimmy. Guess who? Nah, this is tough. This is tough. This is tough. This is may tough. I? You may. May I? You may. I have class. But even after messing around with all of the amenities, why are we playing ping pong when we have an entire island? It's important to note that that's not what makes this island special. All the way on the other end of the island are century old ruins that we are yet to explore. Tips on driving. Oh no. All right, you ready? Yeah! We're gonna go off roading a little bit. And this to is back tough. The now. How does Carl always end up driving? Because I'm awesome. Oh, big bump. Ooh, dude, this is like a safari. Yeah, you're going four times the speed limit. I mean, I don't know if there's cops that will stop you, but I'm just letting you know. Is there a jail on this island? No jail. Oh, there's no jail? And when we finally ran out of road to drive on, we started to make our way through what used to be a village of people on this island over a hundred years ago. This used to be a bar? Yep. Yeah, you want to walk under this hundred year old giant thousand pound slab? Sure. Surely it won't fall on top of me. Dude, if today was the day that it fell, you couldn't even be mad. Nolan, come over here before you die. And just past these ruins is easily the best view on the entire island. Whoa. Ooh, yeah, it gets better. We were driving for so long, I forgot we were on an island. Imagine just you and your girl go away for a second on an island, just y'all two, nobody else, chat. That's a fucking movie you are. But guess what? It's not happening. Okay, for you and for me and for everybody, okay? It's not happening, bro. <laughs> the island starts over there, comes all the way around, wraps all the way around here, goes down that coastline, all the way up Damn! over there. I'll be honest, I personally wouldn't pay $45 million for a big jungle with some ancient ruins, but I'm sure some rich guy will. This next island is arguably the second most expensive island that money can buy. This is the $150 million island. It comes with eight mega luxurious island! mega mansions. And the best part is, it's completely powered by solar panels and wind turbines. It's home to some of the most exotic animals I've ever seen and took over four decades to build. This what? island will literally blow your mind. When I think of a private island, this is what I think of. That's good, because this is a private island. All right. And apparently, the first thing you need to do here is wash your hands. Make sure you don't taint the island with your outside world germs. I've already washed my germs. Does everyone who come here get a coconut? I mean, they're not running low. <laughs> True. I don't know if it's because this place is so fancy, or maybe they just heard about Carl's driving. <laughs> But each of us ended up with our own personal driver. I have a feeling this is gonna be a once in a lifetime experience. Unless you come back. Well, I might be out of my price range. <laughs> and even though this island costs $150 million, you can actually rent it for yourself for the extremely low price of $140,000 per day. I didn't even realize we just went up a mountain. <laughs> I've heard this is the most luxurious private island in the world. It is. The view is insane. This is the great house. But before we were able to explore the great house, my dumb friends got distracted by a turtle. There's a turtle? Get in there! Yeah! <laughs> w right, turtle! You guys go to the rest of the island. <laughs> this island is so extra that for every one person in your party, they have 10 staff members waiting on your every need. There's a bunch what? of people over there like, here's drinks, here's food, what do you want to do over the next few days? And we're just like, turtle. Yeah! And of course, Nolan, of all my friends, wanted to take advantage of this. Yes! Yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's everyone up to over here? Oh, we're playing pool. What? 10 people? They're my hype crew. Like, you don't have to hang out with them to make it feel good. Movie. I will be sad if you don't sit down and relax. Okay. If you need attention, don't make them stand there. It's only been an hour, but I'll say it. Is this is it? the best island so far. On top of all of that, the island has a house with a driving range on the roof where Whoa. you can hit golf balls into the ocean because these are Bobby. made of fish food. Oh. You should probably hit it further so you don't hit someone. Look at all those flamingos. There's so much I can't process it. Well, flamingos in the sky. They're everywhere. 
They don't love us unless we give them food. Come here, my brother. But flamingos aren't the only exotic animals on this island. Whoa! Carl, what? That's a dinosaur. This is so cool. What the And believe it or not, fuck? this tortoise could live to be over 200 years old. Mr. Tortoise, my name is Jimmy. If my descendants, descendants, descendants come here, tell them I was awesome. And afterwards, we got sworn by Bumba! a bunch of lemurs that live on this island. Get over here! Jimmy, I don't know if you noticed that there's two lemurs on your Yeah, I know. I'm trying not to move. I'll put food on there. Oh, please don't. <laughs> and if you're wondering where all of these exotic animals came from, most of them, sadly, are endangered species and are on this island because the owner, Richard Branson, brought all of them here to prevent them from going extinct. But the most endangered animals on this island were the mermaids that served us sushi. Ah, mermaids, mermaids and sushi! This is luxury. Mermaids! Do you guys want sushi? I would say no. Is that cannibalism? Yeah. There's mermaids, my nigga? It's like a family reunion, get over here! There's honestly so much on this island, we can't even film it all. We played tennis, we played basketball, we explored yet another mansion. I did my first cold plunge, you get the idea. There's so much to do on this island, it's actually overwhelming. This one's actually pretty intense. I'm like actually scared of You that. wanna know what else is intense? What? The final island, I'll see you there. Okay, it literally can't get better than this, right? Chat, like it literally can't get better than this. You're telling me it's gonna get better than this? It literally can't get better than this, and you're telling me it's gonna get better than this. Impossible. Show me. Oh. Why are we still here? And on the way to the $250 million island, we stopped in shark infested waters because I have to pay for this video. And now that I'm surrounded by sharks, and what feels like my worst nightmare, I'm gonna tell you guys about some of guys. Oh, they're so close, oh my gosh. And the worst part is, I'm not coming out until I'm done with this ad. Stumble Guys is a free to play mobile play. Stumble Guys, you sponsored me one time. Stumble Guys, you sponsored me once. It was a beautiful experience, Stumble Guys. Stumble Guys, hit my jack, Stumble Guys. Stumble Guys, go ahead and hit my jack. All right? I love Stumble. Chad, you remember doing the summertime? We did summer uh, Stumble Guys? Do y'all remember that? Bro, that shit was actually hilarious, I'm not gonna lie. Player game, where 32 people compete for the crown. You have to be an absolute maniac to do this. Not even Stumble Guys could pay me to do this. Why are you all here, Sharks? Uh oh. Oh, they're so close, they're so close. And for their new season, they went all out with new Mr. Beast skins, animations, and emotes. <laughs> Loki's coming right at me. Bro, this is wild. I want to make sure there's enough sharks for Jimmy. They also added a brand new level. You have to follow a pattern as long as possible to stay alive. And the longer you live, the harder it gets. Oh, the shark's hitting me. I think the sharks are hitting the cave. No, it's rocking. Oh, this is scary. I also just released my brand new toolkit, so you can build your own Mr. Beast level. This is one of their best seasons ever. You need to try my new Mr. Beast level, plus build your own, and I want to see what you guys come up with. Oh, the sharks keep hitting the cage, so I'm going to get out of here. Make sure you download Stumble Guys for free, so I don't have to go back to the shark cage. You're alive. Let's go do more things that have nothing to do with sharks. Please. And now that I've paid off the debt I've incurred here we from go, this here video, we go. let's here we visit go. the $250 million island. This is a $250 million private island. This- Nigga, that's a fucking country! Nigga, what?! This is a 250- Nigga, this is a country, bruh. Bruh! Bro, what the fuck?! $250 million private island. This extraordinary island has an entire amusement park with over a dozen water slides. It also has its own hot air balloon and just about- oh, what the fuck is that? What the fuck? Every activity you could ever imagine. And we have it all to ourselves. There are no other guests here, but out of every feature you've seen on these islands so far, this one stands above the rest. In the middle of the island is a massive water slide. Even though literal eight-year-olds ride that water slide, I might still check it out because I'm afraid of heights. But before taking on the water slide, we checked out the other features, like how there's over a hundred jet skis on this island. It's a bit overkill. And not to mention, there's a literal zip line that spans across man-made beaches. Can I imagine it's your birthday and you, have to, and you get invited like a thousand people and y'all celebrate that sh this shit for like a week straight. It's just lit 24-7 like. What's the helmet for? What am I gonna hit? The ground, bro. Because sometimes people fall off. This All is, like, your really friends, scary. <laughs> family, Thank everybody. You. Carl, you're kind of far behind. This is awesome. 
Um, this is actually not that crazy. And if you own this island, you can host over 13,000 of your friends at any of these five guard- Fuck a thousand. This nigga just said 13,000. Gantuan pools. Oh. oh. This kind of looks like it was made in Minecraft. Who has 13,000 friends, my nigga? And it's so funny just seeing my two friends in it. Nolan looks like a tiny speck for $250 million. You, Cap, I don't got 13,000 fucking friends, nigga. No the fuck I don't, nigga. Okay, you see, I'm about to say I got 8.8 .8 million friends. But then again, I don't want the parasocialness to get worse, okay? Because if I call y'all my literal friends, it's going to be at least... 15 niggas in this chat who is actually gonna believe that and they're actually gonna like word Y'all ni niggas my dog chat no 100% But we go we're not gonna say it out loud for the niggas in the back You feel me? This island of course has exotic animals. <laughs> is that a peacock <laughs> sir? I need to take you in for questioning sir And even every game you can imagine I wish there was the 13,000 people that are normally here to watch how bad he is at Cornwall. Is that soccer pool? This island has things what? I didn't even know existed. But something I noticed is that there were way too many lifeguards at this island for just the four of us. How many lifeguards are on this island? Oh, over 100. Really? With this many lifeguards, you would have to try to drown. <laughs> so I thought it would be fun if we gave them all the day off. Has anyone ever rented this island before? Wow, this is a first. Dude, you are leaning back, You look way too relaxed. And after all the 100 lifeguards went down, they decided to hype up me and the boys for our turn to go down the slide. Yeah! Here we go! Oh! oh, 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 oh. Chat, no cap. No cap! We should rent it on the amusement park and all go. Tight shit. No cap, but it's super organized, bruh. No cap. Look, look, look. I ain't gonna cap, bruh. No cap, super organized, super lit, right? No cap, I think part two. Okay, here we fucking go, bro. Give me a fucking break, my nigga. Give me a fucking break, okay? No cap, chat. Me and Yachty was talking about doing an AMPX concrete, like, amusement park lit-ass day. That low key will be lit, right? Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, that would be hard. I'm a C chat. That's actually a banger. And like, sub only will be tough. <laughs> Yo! Oh my god. Boys, you wanna know what's even scarier than that? What? That one. Why is it so terrifying? <laughs> it looks so scary. <laughs> uh, we can skip it. Towering at over 135 feet tall, this is the tallest water slide in all of North America. I don't even know what I'm looking at. <laughs> it's like a skyscraper. But I'm scared. <laughs> Daredevil's Peak. What a soothing name. Very inviting. Oh, we're so high. Oh, it's kind of freaking me out. All right, we made it to the top. Are you guys just waiting for us up here? Listen to how intense the wind is up here. Oh, don't look down. Look how crazy the island looks. Oh my god. Hey, right, Carl. You're right? No. Oh, no one. Oh! Yeah. Would you say no scopes is enforceable? No scopes is enforceable. There we yeah. go. Hey, the last card said you gotta go, Nolan. I love you, Mom. I'll see you on the other side. Alright, go. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god, I hit my truck. Let's do this! <laughs> ah! You better come down after me. Okay. Oh God. Why is it so fast? Is it actually that scary? Ah! I'm gonna do this for your entertainment, even though giant rides scare me. Here we go. Here we go. And even though I was basically just drowning the entire time down the water slide, I gotta say this whole island was pretty awesome. Oh yeah, and one more thing. Make sure you use this QR code to download Stumble Guys and you can win $10,000. What? Make sure you use this QR code to download Stumble Guys and you can win $10,000. Need that motherfucker? Fuck you talking about? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs>